Hey, I'm Brad Lancaster, author of Rainwater Harvesting for Drylands and Beyond, and the website HarvestingRainwater.com. It's getting hot here in Tucson, but it's no problem here in the sweet garage, one car garage turned cottage, because of a lot of great free passive cooling strategies. And I want to show you how I'm monitoring, monitoring how well we're doing, and then I want to show you a real cool seasonal strategy we've got. So, right to my right here is a little indoor thermometer, and I want to show you the temperature right there. All right, let it adjust just barely over 70 degrees. But outside, that's the outdoor thermometer. Woo, it's already over 90, and we're up at the end of March here. Okay, so that's telling me that we're doing good, but we can do even better. And I'm going to show you how we're going to do that. Okay, we come on outside here. I want you to look at the south facing side of the building. I want you to look up there and look at the shadow being cast by that roof overhang. Sweet! Not a bit of sun hitting the south facing windows. So that sun is not heating us up in the upper story. But here down below, we are getting some sun. Now that things have warmed up for the season, we're going to shade that by extending this overhang. Nice! All right, so here we are. We're going to take it from the winter position and turn this awning into its summer position. In the winter position, it gives us more sun, but... After we extend it, we get more shade. Okay, you can see that we have just extended this section of the seasonally extendable or retractable overhang. So the next thing we'll do is we'll extend this part so the whole south facing side of the building will be in shade for free passive cooling all summer long and into our hot and warm fall. Hey Vaughn, down there in the shade, are you nice and cool in that free Cooling shade? Yeah! Right on! Okay, so now that we have extended the overhang for the hot months, the whole south facing wall is in shadow, and even that strip there will be in shadow as we get closer to summer. Because again, today is March 31st. Because as we get closer to summer, the angle of the sun will get more vertical, and so the shadow will lengthen. So let's go check out underneath this overhang. Oh, very nice. And as we get further in, into summer, this whole area will be a shadow corridor. Yeah, like that. So now, I'm um, nice and cool. And if you want more information on these simple, free, passive strategies to cool your home in the hot months and heat your home in the cool months and cold months, check out my books, Rainwater Harvesting for Drylands and Beyond, and my website, HarvestingRainwater.com. Yeah!